This tutorial will be about how to manually patch a character in order to make them compatible with the ADD004 patch. For reference, I'm using Mugen 1.1. Here are some examples of common errors that occur when attempting to auto-patch a character and how to fix them. Problem 1. Error window at the versus screen. Usually a problem with the misspelled command in the character's CMD file. The input notations that are defined in the character's CMD file and declared in the CNS file must match the spelling as seen in the associated add004 common1.cns located in the data folder. Any discrepancy will result in a crash and a pop-up error during the versus screen resembling something like this. Solution. Correct all of the declared input notations in the character according to the associated common1.cns. It's recommended to use the add004 patch tool first before making the necessary corrections. Doing this means having a backup auto-created of the original character prior to both the automated patch process as well as any post-patch manual co-edits we make in order to fix the character. Let's look at some examples. Date Masamu. Usually the first notation or naming structure that's returned is the giveaway as to the source of the problem. In this case, the recovery command is labeled as recover, which is causing the error. Copy quote unquote recover, including the parentheses. Replace all instances of this phrase with the phrase quote unquote recovery, including the parentheses, in the CMD file and the CNS file. And that's it. This solution may work for other Sengoku Basar characters and Guilty Gear characters with the same issue. True K. If the first thing we see are button notations at the top of the error window, we know it's most likely a button command issue. Looking at the declared commands, we can see that they are mislabeled. Toggle on K sensitivity for your find replace function. Replace all the capitalized commands in the CMD and CNS with the correct lowercase notations. Replace capital C with lowercase x. Replace capital D with lowercase y. Replace capital A with lowercase a. And replace capital B with lowercase b. And that's it. Many SNK clone characters require similar steps in order for them to function in ADD004. Byakuya. From the error window, we know it's most likely a button command issue. Examining the command declarations, we can see that the command lowercase a is absent. We'll need to add it into the character's CMD file. Add this block of code here. In this case, the character doesn't use the a button, but it still has to be present in the character code in order to achieve compatibility with the add004 program. Manual patching method. Problem one, animation error or missing life bar. Cause, usually a problem with the character's animation format or order. Also happens more frequently with characters who use multiple CNS files. Solution, a manual patch of the character. Examples, whole horse. In this case, after auto patching the character, he still plays as if he is unpatched with the missing life bar. So we will manually patch the character. Open add004pi.ini. There are three separate sections we will need to copy and paste into three distinct files. We'll use this file to add code into the CNS, the command file, and the animation file. Let's start with the CNS. You'll know where to start and end a copy based on the add.basic start and add.basic end phrase. Copy everything between these two lines. Paste the block of code immediately under wherever the character's state def negative two declaration is located. Use this same understanding to repeat the process for the animation code. Either open the air file with the notepad or if you're using Fighters Factory, then click on the director symbol, navigate to the animations menu and toggle on text mode. Scroll down to the bottom of the error file and copy and paste the designated code. Lastly, do the same for the command file. Similar to the steps of pasting the CNS code, we want to look for the state def negative one declaration and paste the correct code under there. 
and that's how you manually patch a character. Use this step as a last resort if all other steps fail because chances are it will work for most characters. Thanks for watching.